the Atlanta Hawks have beaten the Miami Heat for the seventh seed. It's too early to even get footage, so I'm just going to use this picture and talk on it. But yeah, Atlanta surprising a lot of people with the win against Miami, and they were showing Miami's, exposing Miami's big weakness they've had already for a while. So, Atlanta won by 15, I believe, or 13. No, they won by 11, 116-105. Atlanta makes it to go against Celtics, and, you know, what I believe is that the Celtics is going to win in five. But Atlanta wins the Miami Heat. Miami looking pretty bad that game. Jimmy Butler did not have a good late game. Atlanta had a pretty solid game with Clint Capella being the MVP of the team, having 20-something rebounds, and that's the exposing. The Heat had four guards and basically only had Bam out of bio as a center, and Bam is also not really tall. He's like 6'9 as a center, while the Hawks has so many good rebounders like Clint Capella, John Collins and Sadiq Bey and DeAndre Hunter. They get so many offensive rebounds. Like a lot of plays when I was watching the game. They were getting the offensive rebounds always. They had like Kyle Lowry guarding John Collins. That was really bad. But yeah. So second chance points. And the rebounding. Offensive rebounding for the Atlanta Hawks. Basically won them the game because. They got the rebound. It was too easy for them to get the rebound. It's like every other play, they get an offensive rebound. Because the Heat players are too short. Also, Jimmy Butler and Bam Adebayo did not have a good game. Kyle Lowry carried with 33 points. And Tyler Hero was solid as well. But not many people were doing good. Like Jimmy Butler was decent but had a bad shooting night. And then Bam only dropping like 8 points or something like that. Not a good night for him at all. The Hawks had good defenders. DeAndre Hunter guarding Jimmy Butler. And yeah. So. The Hawks role players also did well. Like Sadiq Bey was good. They had like. Clint Capella of of course was good. DeJounte Murray did pretty decent. Scoring I believe. 17 or 18. Trey Young did pretty decent too. Bogey was a nice per- a player too for them. So yeah, the Atlanta Hawks got the dub. And Miami Heat are in danger of not even making the playoffs. That's basically it. Thank you guys for watching. We're out.